Hello again my friends, today I'm going to show you how to edit VFX in Frosty Editor for PVC GV2. Before you get started, make sure you have the Color Picker plugin installed. First, open the FX folder, and I'm going to open Zombies, Captain Brains, Mod, Toxic, single click on Super Mode, and open the Effect Blueprint. Open the object, open the components, and open the light effect entity data. Then open light, and as you can see we have XYZ color values here. So I'm going to click on tools, and select color picker menu. For the hexadecimal, I'm going to input the crimson hex code, as I want a crimson toxic overload. Copy the generated XYZ values, and paste them to the color section. Scroll down and do the same thing to the other light effect entity item. Once you're done, open the Super Mode folder, single click Emitters, and open the first emitter. Go up to the search bar and do a search for color. Open the template data low, open root processor, and open a bunch of next processors. Replace the XYZ values with the ones from the color picker menu. Repeat this step for the other emitter documents of the folder. After you finish, you can save your project, and I'll call mine Red Toxic Overload. Let's launch the game to see if Toxic Overload is crimson instead of green. It definitely is! So that is how you edit VFX. Special thanks to Natalie for providing the color printer plugin used to make this. Thanks for watching, and I hope you have a happy Halloween.